Hi everyone, I'm just going to record this one in uh, kind of one take without any kind of edits or, edits or anything like that in it because um, I've just got some information that I want to convey to you all um, relating to my um, brain tumour. Um, I put a, uh, back in um, August I ended up in um, A&E um, um, after a after a seizure, basically that 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 I didn't quite recover my arm from after having the surgery. Is the seizure the seizure? So um, so the um, the ambulance people when they came, they they put the stroke lights on and uh, and um, and you know I had to go um, be rushed to A and E, and then I had another seizure on the on the back of the bench, and then they gave me some kind of um, I think it was like tamazepam or something intravenously to to kind of calm me down and that kind of that kind of sorted me out. Um, but you know, it seems like like maybe they were treating my case as like an epilepsy case rather than a brain tumor case. Because in hindsight, I'm sort of thinking maybe I I should have got a scan at that time because they discharged me and. And um, you know, a, a month later, just in 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 the end of September, um, I've I've, en I've ended up in A and E again, puking. I've been really sick, and and I wasn't able to orientate myself or anything. I needed help, like stand standing up, and I, I couldn't perform like basic executive functions and stuff like that. And it turned out my brain was like swelling really badly. And um, and I had to wait from from like I think I was it I was in from Saturday till till Friday the following week um, waiting for an, for an MRI. When I finally get the MRI, of course um, they've 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 told me it's a it's looking like a, a geoblastoma, which is like a, a grade four. Um, So, what that means now, um, I mean, they, they kind of got it wrong because they said that that was the swelling at the time, but it turns out, like, when I've spoken to my neurosurgeon last week, he said that's not, that wasn't, that wasn't the swelling, it was, it's, it's actually the cancer, so it's three by three by, by five um, centimetres, and it's kind of like a big lump now, and there's kind of... There's um there's necrosis in there as well, um, so I'm a bit I'm a bit like I wish I wish they'd got this in 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 August because as it's growing it's it's growing exponent exponentially now and it's eating parts of my brain so I've just got to wait for this surgery which is going to be in about a week or so um, which I've just and and um, and then, uh, you know, just to get to get it out, basically. So yeah, um, you know, how do I feel about it? <laughs> Obviously, I feel shit about it. Obviously, I feel terrible about it. You know, like, um, you know, I, I have a lot of confidence in my su in my surgeon. Um, I think he's gonna have to get like over over ninety percent for it to to to, to mean anything. And then looks like I'll have to go straight into to radiotherapy no, no matter what state I'm in after the after the uh, surgery <laughs> um, because there's a, there's quite a higher chance of stroke with this this surgery. It's going to be a an asleep surgery, not like like last year when I had it. I had it uh, an awake craniotomy. This this time it's going to be an asleep claim, craniotomy because he's got he's got to be able to get right in there. And apparently there's a more of a risk of swelling this time, um, just because of the behaviour of the tumour. Um, so there's 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 more risks in this one, I think. Um, and um, but the, the the real risk is not doing it because basically I'm a goner if I don't do it now. Um, so um, so yeah, I've got to do it. <laughs> I want to live like <laughs> I want to live. So yeah. Um, so that's 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 what's going on here. I know I've I've arranged with lots of different people to do live streams in the meantime and stuff. I really still want to keep that up. 
um, you know, as soon as I, as soon as I get back on form after my surgery. Um, but you know, obviously, obviously, I've got to I've got to um, prioritize this right now, um, and just just put everything else on the back burner, back burner a little bit. Um, sorry that this is this is a bit rambly. It's 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 hard to break this kind of news to people, and and and. Um, and um, it's tiring as well, but I see, I feel better once everybody knows what's the, what the situation is. Um, and um, I guess I'll take a, a bit of a break. Yeah, I just want to say, like you know, I, I think the surgery will go okay. Uh, you know, I, I do trust my surgeon and everything. Um, and and that this this will be that this will you know it will sort itself out. But you know, if, if if something does happen, I just want you all to know. Like, I'm really happy with the way that I've lived my life. I'm really proud of the way that I've lived my life, and um, you know, I'm not 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 compromising and 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 living honest, trying to live honestly um, and and fairly and treat people fairly, and um, and so I'm 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 good with all that with what I've done and everything. But obviously, you know. I want to. I want to continue. I want to continue. I really do. Um, so, so um, I, I, you know, expect to see more of me. <laughs> expect to see more of me. Um, and you know, I love you guys, and 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 I love the community that I've created here, and I hope it continues other people to do the same and and say what stand up for what they believe in, because. As I've always said, you know, there's a lot more worry to about a lot more to worry about than being called silly names, you know, and uh, what people think of you and things like that. Um, you know, I don't give a shit. I don't give a flying shit if I don't give a shit if people make fun of me over this. <laughs> it's the least of my worries. So you know. Um, I'm just I'm just proud of what I've done, and and, uh, and I hope to continue it more. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry to give shit news though. Uh, I'm really proud of what 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 the women are doing over in Britain at the moment, and just generally, and um, and that I'm part of it, and that I'm part of that. Um, you know, uh, uh, yeah. But, you know, if I don't see you again, so long and thanks for all the fish, I guess. <laughs> but, yeah, I, I think it'll be all right. I think it'll be all right. I'm going to fight. I'm going to fight. That's all I can do, really. And at least, you know, if I lose this way, it wasn't a man that brought me down, was it? It was just a random thing, random thing, you know. I still, I still stuck it to the man the whole way all my life and I'm going to continue as long as I can and I hope that I hope that makes you feel a bit I hope that eases this this news a bit um, um, somewhat because you know I, I plan to fight I really do either way so um, anyway thanks for listening to my rant I, I hope to get a more um, I hope to get something more um, more information to you um, in the next video um, the actual information I'm going to try and um, sh you know sh try and keep people updated on my Instagram and on my Twitter as much as I can so everybody knows that I'm doing alright and stuff um, um, in the meantime so keep an eye out on all that on all those you know on all those other social media uh, that I use um, if you want to, if you want to keep, if you want to keep in the loop, um, I think that's all. That, that's that's all I've got to say, really. Uh, I just, I just, I just felt like I'd, I had to let you all know what's going on. Magdalene's got a geoblastoma. <laughs> it's not what you want for yourself, is it? Really, it's not what you wish for. It's bollocks. <sighs> Fucking hell. But yeah. These things are sent to try us, aren't they? So, yeah. Peace out. Take care of yourselves. And uh, keep fighting.